hello guys welcome to another video on wp blogger youtube channel on this channel we teach beginners all the tips tricks and hacks you need in order to use wordpress successfully in today's video we are going to learn how to use the regenerate thumbnails plugin we are going to learn how to use this plugin you see right here before we get started into today's video if you are new to the channel please subscribe and enable the notification bell to receive alerts anytime i drop one of my awesome videos like and share this video with your friends and if you have any other questions don't forget to leave them in the comment box below now if you want the best wordpress experience i recommend you use bluehost bluehost is the hosting platform we use and that is what i recommend click on the link below this video come to the home page of bluehost just click on get started it will bring you to this page and select any package to get started with the best WordPress hosting platform. Now let's get started into today's video. Like I said, we are going to learn how to use regenerate thumbnails. It automatically regenerates all your image thumbnails. So let's check out a few, a few description about this plugin, then we we'll continue. It says regenerate thumbnails allows you to regenerate all thumbnail sizes for one or more images that have been uploaded to your media library. This is useful for situations such as a new thumbnail size has been added and you want past uploads to have a thumbnail in that size. You've changed the dimension of an existing thumbnail size for example, via settings or media. This third scenario is what most of you are facing. You switch to a new WordPress theme that uses featured image of a different size. That is the problem most of us are facing and that is why you need the Regenerate Thumbnails plugin. Most often we work with a plugin for some time maybe a month or even a year and we want to switch to a new theme or we have switched to a new theme you get to find out your featured images have different sizes and they are not looking professional on your new theme based on the old media files you've uploaded we are going to learn how to use regenerate thumbnail to solve this problem the first step is to um, copy this name here and let's come to our plugin session and click on add new. Here I will search for regenerate thumbnails. So this is the thumbnail we are looking for and I'll click on install now. Once installation is complete, let's click on activate. Activation is complete. So let's look for the settings of regenerate thumbnails. Let, not at the media session. Let's go to tools. So it's here, regenerate thumbnails. Just click on it right here, as you see in the video. It says keep regenerating existing correctly sized thumbnails yes let's skip it do we do you want the old thumbnail files to be deleted you can select if no leave them as such then we have regenerate thumbnails for all 28 attachments and regenerate thumbnails for the 11 featured images only i'm going to go for regenerate thumbnails for all 28 attachments so i'll click on this button here for the regeneration to begin i don't know if it will take a long time because it's just 28 images here 
So let's start. If it's, it's taking too long, I'll pause this video and once the regeneration has completed, I'll come back to this video for us to continue with our tutorials. So our regeneration has finished successfully. All 28 thumbnails has finished regenerating. So guys, this is how to regenerate old uploaded media files in your library, especially if you change your team and you see that the featured images come with different images. So the old post on your WordPress site it's not looking professional on your site. Just install regenerate thumbnails, regenerate all the thumbnails in your website and have a professional look on the front end for users to really see great um, image sizes and also looking very professional. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If so, smash that like button give me the thumbs up it means a whole lot to me and don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you are new leave all your questions and suggestions inside the comment box below before i take leave i have prepared some resources for all wordpress beginners check the description box below this video you will see the various resources i'm talking about go through them they are meant to help you move from a beginner in WordPress to an expert in WordPress. They are meant to help you have and build a better WordPress business online. Until I come your way with another awesome video, it's bye-bye from WP Blogger.